Hey man, it's the ISO God Sensei, the greatest known 2K in existence. And look, are you trying to figure out why you are missing, wide open, and you timed it perfectly? Some new information is leaked that there is no pure green window in NBA 2K25. Now I'ma give y'all a take that y'all have not heard, and it is the truth, okay? And we're gonna be showing y'all some new jump shot green window information and some proof that uh this could possibly be true. But before we get into all that, y'all make sure y'all subscribe if y'all are new. We'll be keeping you up to date with all the best jump shots, builds, dribble moves, and hilarious gameplay. And make sure y'all hit that like button. It's free. No one will know, man. Don't be a hater. So firstly, this guy tweets out, I guess because of some DM, I asked 2K Lab and they said some DM got taken out of context or something. I don't know. But he said, according to 2K Lab, there is no pure green window in NBA 2K25. Even on high risk reward shooting, the full bars are actually back in the game. Okay, now this led to a lot of people tweeting, people been tweeting and complaining about the shooting, about how they're timing it perfectly and they're in takeover, they're missing, all, all sorts of stuff. Now here's the truth. Here's that real. There has never been a pure green window in any 2K when you play online. Maybe that offline stuff, but when you play online, there are algorithms. I've been telling y'all, bro. I look, 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 I'm gonna break it down to you. Think, 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 think. If I'm on a 99-3 build with all these Hall of Fame shooting badges in like, you know, 24 or 23, and I'm building up the green machine and I'm in takeover, why am I then missing? Think about that. I know so I know so many of y'all can relate. Think. Does the timing change? They are choosing certain players that can reach certain percents and they're making you miss that shot, okay? It makes no sense. Think, you you should barely even have to time it. All the time, I'll be three for three for three from three in a lethal zone, okay? I'm not even talking about this year 2K. I'm talking about the other 2Ks that they said had a pure green window. In a lethal zone, three for three from three, 100% from the field, in takeover. It's shooting from a lethal brick. Come on, bro. I'm not a, hey, you could call me a lot of things, but I ain't stupid, boy. You know, I'm real elite with my shooting. I sh Last year, I shot 75% plus from three. I know what I'm talking about, bro. I'm not stupid. And then that's not the takeover the lethal the green machine and then just everything and the best jumper wide open come on dog i'm not dumb bro they've been doing this in every 2k there is rng to limit the top it's always been like that in every 2k that that's what full whites are full whites are when you green the shot and it gives you a white even in the golden era they had it but they actually showed you oh you hit the green and you still missed it <laughs> But now went like right when 18 hit or right when 17, I'm pretty sure 17. Then they stopped that you missing greens, but it, it's purely just a visual thing, bro. You literally are missing perfectly timed shots in every single 2K. It's not just the golden era. You know, back then you could time a shot perfectly and it will still show white, right? I believe the newer 2Ks, they are way more RNG than the golden era anyway. I ain't gonna hold you, bro. It's just like, it's just like for instance, I remember in 23, I could shoot way better on bigger builds with way less shooting badges a supposedly worse jump shot compared to my little guard come on bro it it doesn't it doesn't make sense it was just effort and it's not just because my hands are bigger i can hit my release bro no when you have way more badges we talking like silvers compared to purples and way more come on dog like people not dumb and there's people in my discord right who be using them damn devices you know they telling me that they charging like a hundred or whatever the script or whatever that's pathetic, man. 100 to just ruin the game. And they saying the things that I'm going to be telling y'all in this video, okay? That they can't just score every time, da, 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 that it's making a miss. I don't know. And also, a lot of y'all did not ever play a cheater before. I might have played a cup. And that's because I was streaming. Most people, probably like 97% of people who claim they played a cheater last year, they really didn't, bro. It's hella rare. You'd have to go to like the stage. But now probably this year, th th this is why I said take the meter out the casual modes. Y'all, the consumers, y'all are going to see way more cheaters than um you actually did before. Because they can't cheat in competitive modes, or at least most of them. So they're going to come cheat in casual modes. I said just take out the shot meter for everybody. But hey. but anywho, this could be an example. You know, he missed a green. It made him miss. Or it could just be the game. Who knows? 
So the 2K lab actually confirmed there's no pure green window, or is it a room? They're saying they couldn't really find one doing a video soon, but they said that they only tested it with bronze badges, no jump shot boost. I'm telling you, bro, if you're decent at the game, I know a lot of people, they like to say people are complaining and stuff. You can tell that it, it's it's like this, and it's been like, okay? But now it's probably, it's more severe. That That's what it's seeming like. Now he's talking about this chart right here where they said there was a hundred, I guess somewhat. He said it was done on creator day and he hasn't been able to replicate it highest he got was 90 percent both were done day one going to redo it soon hey 2k lab does provide a lot of useful information but it's not always you know because like you you gotta really play online with it bro and you can really see what's going i know a lot of people they be lying you know when they miss shots and stuff but bro you can tell dog like especially when you use certain type of builds with certain type of speeds and you're in those them 90 thresholds man they, they be getting you, dog. Now, here's what Badge got to say. Long story short, 99 three-point wide open in a lethal off-legend dimer. Perfect timing, and you'll still miss like one out of three shots out of 10. The hell is he talking about? <laughs> you, got, you got my head hurting. See, look, this is what I'm talking about. So he, t I guess he tested this. Like even, bro, guys. I don't, I don't think y'all understand this. People are also saying when you give people the ball with like Hall of Fame Dimer, they say, oh, it's a different release. It's faster, but still it should boost your green window to where like, bro, are you really mistiming it that bad? I'm telling you, it's taking you into a range that messes with the algorithm and it's making you miss sometimes, bro. I'm telling you, bro. Like, look, like 99, all those badges, the lethal, then Legend Dimer, that should be like an auto make. There's a reason that like you're missing it, bro. I'm telling you, you should never be penalized for timing your shot. Exactly. Hey, but and one more thing. Sometimes RNG is somewhat good in some aspects, but not it, it shouldn't be so overwhelming, you know? He wants to lower the shooting, smaller green window. He doesn't want to do this, right? His whole thought process is cooked. He's thinking, oh, if they lower the smaller green window to where me and pe people like me and you are hitting less, that means the casuals aren't going to hit at all. So what he's thinking is to just have an algorithm to make us miss even when we're timing it perfectly and still bring that bottom side up. This is why all mu multiplayer games are getting cooked. You can even tell with the gameplay, right? He's just nerfing and killing offense instead of fixing defense because he believes and them devs believe that if you really improve defense and make it like the golden era they think the casual won't enjoy the game that's why defense isn't in the game so his solution is to just keep killing offense and make it unrealistic slow and clunky all this and just keep destroying it instead of actually making lateral quickness faster and making you more bumpy and you know buffing the contest and buffing the paint defense contest his solution is to just destroy offense predetermined drives predetermined movement a lot of like a lot of you know it's really bad bro i mean that y'all are really letting him kill the game all because like y'all hate certain type of players y'all are letting him kill the game you once loved bro i'm telling you because this is not 2k this is nba live now hank the tank i know a lot of y'all hate hate hank the tank i think he's some snob nose or whatever but look hank is cold at every game Okay, especially after 2K18, we not even talking uh 2K. He good at all them games, multiverse, Valorant, you know. I don't know what happened. He went into a, a hyperbolic time chamber and just became great at gaming. He went in all type of championships on the Fortnite, the Valorant, all, everything, okay? He's even saying that he's noticing RNG. After you make two shots in a row, you shouldn't be penalized for making multiple shots in a row and be given a smaller green window. That's exactly what it is, and that's what... I've been telling y'all, bro, you make your shots, you're going to miss. I remember even in uh, Lethal last year, right? I would make my shots four in a row or whatever, and I would activate my takeover. Y'all would, y'all probably don't even know. Right when I activate my takeover, I start missing. That makes no sense. It makes no sense. There's no way just the release is just that different. When I'm, I'm really, I'm focusing on my hands and I'm missing. Like, come on, man. Hey, look, this guy has a 93 win percent, right? RNG mechanic, 2K25. You miss one shot, you're going to miss the next few. It's confused that people saying it's a skill gap. Got to be negative win percent players. Hey, they the death of gaming. <laughs> oh, my soul, bro. Bro, they talk so crazy. Because what about no pure green window with a bunch of RNG set at very low threshold? Da, 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 da. Am I missing something? Don't let anyone twist my words here. I'm not asking for a shooting buff. I even said to lower the green window. If that's what we got to do to get rid of the RNG. Yeah, to be honest, I'm not asking for a shooting buff. Or, you know, 
they got to uh, fix that RNG. Like, just because I make three shots, don't make me miss. That's corn. I mean, fix your game, though. People are also tweeting that uh, they're not noticing uh a buff when they enter takeover. I'm telling y'all, it's, it's all by design. I'm telling y'all that real. You ain't gotta believe me, bro. I always try to say somebody crying or something. Man, get off your knees. Stop double twisting. Stop trying to max out them damn glue hands badge, boy. And then like, if you get hit with Dimer, bro, that sh shot should be easy. Especially Legend Dimer. It should be. But I think I think they're scared of like people shooting full court shots or something. I don't know what they doing, but I'm telling you, stuff you be hearing, that cap. Anywho, click the video on the screen if you want to learn how to make the best centers and power forwards in NBA 2K. 25. But hey, hey, here we go again. Yeah. Here, here we go again. People talking this, but when this hit the fan, everything I'm that made me. Now break it down. Yo, off the top of the dome. dome.